Uh, today I'm going to show you how to set up a very simple uh, home network uh, using built-in tools in FOSSA PUP64. So this is my host machine which is running FOSSA PUP64 but it has a, it's been uh, uh, set up with a tiling window manager called BSPWM so unlike the default of FOSSA pub if I uh, start a uh, rocks file it takes up the whole screen another rocks file it takes up the whole uh, uh, another half of screen and so on so and this is a tiling manager so it looks slightly different but basically f underneath the function is the same also, I need to mention there is a one large uh, terabyte uh, hard drive within this machine and uh, I've broken into separ separate partitions and this is a, a partition that I want to share because it has all the data uh, such as uh, ISO files and, and then uh, all the movies and music and photos and so on. So. Uh, in fact, we can just take a look at the, uh, how this uh, partition, uh, the partition size is 800 gig and it's using uh, almost 600 and uh, so it is very large and it's got a lot of files uh, under the uh, subfolders. So that's, the, that's what I want to share. The first thing what we want to do is when you set up a uh, home network uh, using Puppy Linux is take a look at the uh, a ra uh, firewall. So we can go ahead and right click and then look at the firewall setup. Now uh, just remember this is the host and server side. So what we need to do is uncheck these two and just simply check these two Samba, Samba client and uh, so on. So although it says Windows, we will not be using Windows at all, but uh, we'll be uh, file sharing uh, with the two Puppy Linux uh, machines, uh, particularly with a Fossa Pup where it's uh, set up. So that's uh, properly set. Next thing what we need to do is find out IP address of this host machine. So we'll go ahead and uh, uh, start the terminal and go ahead and go ahead if config and then uh, I only have ETH0 which means it only has a uh, uh, Ethernet and no Wi-Fi in this machine so uh, what's important is to recognize this is the IP address is 192.168.1 20 in my case so I'll have to remember that to set up a uh, client side later so take a look at the Samba so what we need to do is Samba simple management we'll go ahead and start that and when this is green it means it's active so it's ready to receive and send files back and forth so where I have it set up, I call this my main uh, machine, my, uh, my main PC, so I just uh, name it main. And this is the partition that I want to share. So this is this, so we can go ahead and take a close look. And then where, where it is, it's under mount, MNT, and it's uh, 4 right here so that's why I want to share and this is here and I I named it main and APA ma uh, dash main so it's easy for me to remember and uh, when I set it up on the client side and then I can test it see if it all everything works as expected and then uh, indeed everything works and there's okay okay on the bottom so that's working and then we can apply. So now it's running and the whole side is completely set up. So we'll just give it a minute. So we can quit it at this point, but it is still running in the background. Now this is the client uh, uh, 
a laptop uh, here, so I'll be connecting to a, a server, my main uh, desktop computer. So it's also running a Fossa Pub 64, as I mentioned, but uh, yeah, this is not running a, a, a tiling manager. It's just running a default uh, JW, uh, JWM. So first thing we want to do is take a look at the uh, firewall. So let's take a look at the firewall setup. So it can be uh, left pretty much a default uh, setting uh, and uh, you don't necessarily have to uh, click these two at all. So, And then we'll just go ahead and uh, apply or cancel. It's already uh, uh, set as uh, uh, what we want. So next thing what we have to do is uh, 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 start a Samba uh, client software. Go down to network, and what we want is Samba Share Mounter. So we'll go ahead and uh, click that, and default will be blank and edit, setup, and mount. So what we want to do is uh, click the setup. And the username in the puppy is root, password is wolf, wolf, share. Uh, I have it set up as APA main when I set up the uh, when I set up the uh, host uh, server side and then uh, IP address is 192.168.1 and 20 and then we can just uh, run a test to see if it works so yes we can see the uh, uh, the partition uh, in the host machine here, so that's good. That tells me that it's uh, it's working. So we'll go ahead and set, const set and give this a unique name, the te uh, network, and we'll go ahead and say up uh, and main as I alluded to in the host machine when I set it up. So okay. And then cancel and share will put the name as APA main and then restart and then quit and, uh, and then although the client software actually quit it uh, remains connected so so this is we can delete the blank Uh, so we'll just ignore this part for now and when we click on APA main we, we're accessing the uh, a host uh, a partition so we can go back and then see where we are we're at root and this folder and we can go back so we're here and we were just in this folder so when you click on that folder, you can see what is connected on the uh, Samba. So we have this uh, available. So right now we're connected and what we can do is, so for example, uh, here, let's see if we can make a, uh, this is a host machine now, so we can go ahead and start a, uh, a terminal in the host machine and then say we'll make up a little uh, simple text here now so we made up a little simple uh, file on the host and then we'll bring that on into the uh, so this is my client machine now and we'll go ahead and from host and we can go ahead and bring it into our present machine which is a client which is my laptop and we'll just copy it so you can see if you can copy it and we can also likewise you can delete it on the host machine and just to uh, 
see what uh, we can do is just go ahead and copy a, uh, a file to the host machine now and uh, we'll just random well we can just whatever the file we can just go ahead and drag it over and then we'll go ahead and just copy it to the host uh, host uh, partition so you can see that it's been co uh, copied and then we can likewise uh, uh, delete it so it's actually more than just uh, copying of uh, files back and forth you can actually edit it and so on so that's way it's set up as a default and uh, we can look at uh, host partition under Linux for example there is a uh, uh, and we can uh, whatever fi file you want to transfer to any folder in your in your uh, client machine we're able to uh, uh, transfer uh, and then copy and so on so I think that should give you an idea how easy it is to go ahead and uh, set up a home Samba network uh, with the built-in tools that makes it super easy in uh, FOSSA PUB 64.